Hey guys, it's Carrie, and I am back. And I was just wondering, are you guys tired of seeing any of the movie magic characters yet? No, well, me either. <laughs> right, I have two more to show you from this movie magic studio series. So the first girl that we're going to be taking a look at is Pop Heart. We're going to get her all dressed up here. Be right back. Pardon me, guys. I want to show you what she looks like out with her outfit off because she does have some pretty good painted on details. So she has, first off, her whole hair has it has this like '60s type style. It reminds me of something that would be you'd, a hairstyle you'd see in like the movie Hairspray. I wonder if that's what they were going for. Hmm. I'll have to figure this one out. Uh, but she does have uh. So, so two-tone hair. We have the, I don't know what this is, like a periwinkle blue and then a midnight blue streak right here and a high pony uh, with a painted on or molded on painted on pink hair tie or hair bow or what do you want to call it? Hair tie. She has bangs. She has um, black straight eyebrows, blue eyes, and then she has like a really, really pale blue eyeshadow that kind of comes to a Cleopatra type point. And then on this eye, she has a little bit of blue dripping on the bottom. I don't know. What is that supposed to represent? Just art, I guess. She does have really, really light pink cheeks and a bubblegum pink lip. She doesn't have a personal bottle that's supposed to go to her. There were only two bottles that came in this set. I think I had mentioned. But I assumed that the two bottles that came in this set were for the two girls that represented the agents, little sisters. So, either way, um, so going down, she's wearing this black and white bathing suit. It's white on the top and black on the bottom of the top half with uh, black polka dots on the top. We have a solid white and a solid black split for the bottom half. And then the solid black has white polka dots and then white polka dots all over her legs to represent tights. Really, really cool. And uh, yeah, let's go on and get her dressed on. We'll take a look at her outfit. Okay, guys, is she not the cutest thing? Look at these white... Okay, so she has pink translucent heart glasses that have a, a pearlescent white paint over the front. And then she has this one-piece dress here that has a very, very um, superhero, like, comic book type um, look to it. It is gold in the top, And then it moves down, and then it has, like, these, like, thought bubbles that says art here. But if you use your decoder glasses, it underneath that blue part says life. So life art or art life. And then um, in the red and the blue, and then in the... And it's white in the background here. You have that uh, dark... Probably a middle... A middle... Medium. That's what I'm looking for. Medium blue here. That's also metallic-y with white dots. And then it's solid all around the bottom. Now, on the bottom half here, you have pink. And it is, um, it's actually flocked in a pink flocking. And then for her shoes, she has pink, flo pink flocked pom-poms on each side. What it is, is, though, it's like raised plastic with the, fro the flocking on it. So it's not going to like be a pom-pom that comes unglued and falls off at some point. That's actually a really good design. Uh, the shoes are transparent. They're almost like jelly shoes, I guess. They're like a transparent, like, yellow color. It's yellowy gold, though. It kind of matches her to the top of her dress. And then the soles are white. And of course, it's got the left and, left and right foot. Um, articulation, same as all the others. Uh, her head's on a, on a ball joint, so it just goes back and forth and up and down and all around. She has movement in the arms and movement in the legs. So you can kind of sort of make her sit. Um, and that's her. She is Starlet's little sister. This is Gamma. Gamma babe. Gamma babe. Gamma girl. Gamma girl or galaxy babe. That's, this is her little sister. So, it's 
pull her out of the bag here. So here is a Glamsonaut. And she has these short little ponies that are up high. And they are a, a periwinkle type blue. Uh, also with a, a aqua type blue. Kind of striped there. She does have silver ponytail holders. And there are two streaks of silver in the front of her hair. Actually, I think there might be more in the, throughout the rest of it too. So maybe it's three-toned. She has a very light, pasty type complexion um, with brown eyes, and it looks like a silver eyeshadow. And that has a little bit of glitter inside it, glitter infested in there. Uh, she does have um, another, she has a silver lip and a little bit of blushing. That's kind of a light pink. She has um, a halter type top. I don't even know how to describe this the sparkle that's in this. I guess it's like a gray um holographic. It's like a holographic type top. And then it's a halter, but it does have a, that little tie on the top. And then she has these sleeves that are also silver with black stripes and then a matching silver bottom with molded on molded on tights there that are like a glycerin type pinkish purple color. So here's all of her stuff. Let's go ahead and get it on her and we'll take a closer look. Okay guys, here she is all put together. I don't know. I think I, I think I found my new favorite. The only thing I don't like about her is I like her glasses. So I like that they have the, the smoky gray lens with the painted on, they're like cat type eyes and they're painted on gold and everything. But I don't like, it feels, the the plastic feels stressed when I put it on her face. Like these tilt up, which means they're a little bit too small for the head. They do, they fit in perfect though. They're not going to fall off, but I just feel like they're a little, like, you see how they like warp in? I feel like that's going to stress the plastic, but I don't know. That's how they're supposed to go, so. Either way. <laughs> uh, so she has this top here that goes over the molded on sleeves here. It looks really, really cool. You have that holographic section in the front with the per painted purple on the side. And then you have a silver painted on zipper that goes to the middle here. And then you have this really cool cage skirt that also is that holographic sparkle to move down to um, the underground. I don't know if it's underwear or just like part of the bathing bodysuit here. So uh, the second piece also continues the holographic coloration with the, the rest of the zipper that lines right up with that zipper. She has her, she has holographic glitter shoes here, which are pretty awesome. I like how they did the glitter on this so much. It's not the glitter, it's not the glitter that comes off. Like it's the, the, ho it's just holographic. It's really, really, really cool. And you guys can see that in the light, right? You can see how cool that is. I'm very impressed by this one. I mean, yes, she's pretty cool herself. She's very, 60s pop art but i i really do love these minis a lot guys i'm really digging them uh but that's all we have for you guys today uh if you like this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and stay tuned we still have another video coming at you uh, maybe a couple more i want to try and see if i can get that studio built so we can see what's up with it <laughs> i know it's just a uh, cardboard but it might be fun to play with and, you know either way <laughs> see you in the next one guys bye